Assalamu alaikum. Hi, Whimsy. Walaikum salam. Polly, tangerine. I look upset. I don't know. Probably because there's no filters. We're going to get yelled at. Reesey, Reesey. It's off. No, Buster, it's not. It's Taco Bell. I'm living on the edge, okay? I'm feeling okay, Nana. I didn't get churros, no. The Taco Bell toilet. I hope not. I never learn. Hey, script goat. That's from The Simpsons, yeah. Yeah, it is. Okay. So... I'm having Taco Bell and I don't give a crap about anything right now because yeah I'm figuring things out I'm in between diets okay so I have some Fiesta potatoes and a quesadilla and a diet Pepsi hi Tammy Kiki hello I'm really hungry because I haven't eaten forever Bismillah. no <laughs> Melly no no it's okay yummy I know so I might do a gaming stream later because I feel like just like relaxing and gaming and playing something creepy. And yeah, the power went out again today. No, I just have the potatoes right now. I'll show you the quesadilla after. I don't feel like using my high table. I don't know. I, I honestly don't like, I don't know. I go through phases where I like cooking and then I hate it. No, I'm just going to eat. I'm not going to explain anything, Millie. Yeah, exactly. Guess what? Yes, buy one, get one free day today. Taco Tuesday, buy one, get one free. So the power went out. And it went out outside of the normal hours when it sometimes goes out. It was like five something. And I wanted to go to Tim Hortons. So maybe tomorrow. I'm actually feeling nostalgic for Tim Hortons. I don't know why. Anyway. Quesadilla chicken. Um, Luigi's Mansion. I find that game hard, but fun. So I put my neck fan on and wash my kitchen floors with a, with my champagne toast candle lit. <laughs> There's a bunch of Tim Hortons here. Brownie. Hi, Orange Pulp. There's a bunch of Tim Hortons. I want to try. They have a double-double. Hi, Serene. I find it hard to play, Mel. You don't find? But I don't have a Nintendo Switch. Mmm, breeze up, is it? Chicken quesadilla. I feel bad for you, Julia, that you're a cat and you can't eat this. <laughs> Let's mean it. Mm. It is a coffee shop, Iona. Hi, Brenda. You're not blocked with pot. So, actually, I'm not even eating tacos on Taco Tuesday. But it's Taco Bell. Okay. Yeah, you can see quesadilla. It's like flat and potatoes <laughs> it's like oh yeah the tim hortons so they have like different items than we have in canada but tim hortons is a canadian company so it makes me a little like patriotic <sighs> hi babe even though in canada i didn't like tim hortons that much but i still i still would drink there sometimes their stuff's there sometimes like their iced coffee actually while i'm so long i didn't finish the brownie experiment <laughs> I didn't finish it because I think like, yeah, you're right. It would have to be like the same conditions every day. I don't know. Maybe another time. Oh. I don't have the same like sleep pattern day to day. Clinical trials. That's right. <laughs> but yeah, I know this is not healthy, but right now, honestly, I don't care. Like, I don't know. I, uh, imagine, imagine, close your eyes and imagine you could never eat Taco Bell ever again. Tim Hortons is a Canadian coffee and bakery chain. And I have to try their coffee. The breakfast sandwiches? Yeah. Honestly, I'm not sure the temperature. I uh, didn't go out there today. The Libra Millie? My aunt's a Libra. She's one of my favorite people. Oh. Fire sauce. Yeah, right. Let's see how hot it is. No, we just ordered it, Brenda. <laughs> French wraps are good. 
the quesadillas are really good. And they give you a huge sour cream. Not like one of those little things. October 20th. Knock on wood. The sciatica is like okay right now. And I was able to like get a lot done today. One thing I hate doing is cleaning the stove. Ugh. Like, you know, like with the oven cleaner and everything, and then you have to take. Like, what I do is, you know, my ele the elements, I wrap them in tin foil. Thanks, Duck Puppet. Grandma Steeler, hello. I hate doing that. Taking the old ones off and putting the new ones on. It's not neuro neuropathy because I can feel everything. And it doesn't go down to my feet. It's just my literal, like, on the right side of my lower back, into the butt cheek, and, like, to the lower calf. But I get muscle weakness sometimes from it. My grandma had bad sciatica. Hip bursitis. What is this? Ashley, yeah, a lot of people who are pregnant get it too. <laughs> I didn't finish the brownie experiment. It's yummy, babe. Do you like yours? I love fiesta potatoes. No, I didn't get dessert, but I have some sugar free cherry sour cherry jello I want to make after. All right, last part of my quesadilla. I seriously am so hungry. I didn't eat. Like, what did I eat today? In the morning. My sleep pattern's kind of improving, actually. Excuse me. Don't I look more alert and awake? I'm on my death bread. Death bread. That sounds edgy. Death bread. Okay. Hot sauce and sour cream. I'm fluffy. I look sleepy. Yeah, it's really good. Oh. <laughs> Rolling down the hill. That was actually really fun. We had no power for two hours. I was fine. I don't know. I was um just listening to like a podcast and cleaning up the kitchen with a candle lit, and then I had a shower. And started watching part of a really bad horror movie. And then the power came back on. <sighs> That's it, folks. I didn't stop Unicity. I'm just like never consistent with anything in my life. So, <laughs> Kevin. Who's getting lipedema surgery? It will not be released in Kuwait. Oh. It wasn't scary bells? Darn. That sucks. I wanted to watch it. Probably. But I'll wait for it to come out. <laughs> Weenie Roast Massacre? Glitter and lasers? I thought she was getting weight loss surgery because I saw that she was like, she did this like TikTok where she was going like this and like going through the airport and then on the plane. And then somebody handed her a gown and she's like, today's the day. So I thought it was like weight loss surgery. I'm still hungry. I think they were talking about putting me on that as her, but maybe I'll mention it at my follow-up appointment. Where's juice? <laughs> There's no backup quesadilla, darn it. Oh, I'll have a Werther's. For dessert I didn't have tacos Laura I had a quesadilla oh really I think five saves life but I guess not hey YouTube lover I'm feeling okay today actually nice ghost face I know the difference Peta I was actually really starving right now Jello or pudding? Pudding. Do I like Dr. Pepper? Yeah. No, we have the same order because it's buy one, get one free today. But you have to pay extra for Fiesta potatoes. Or else you just get fries. Or, uh, actually I think I'll feel okay because I, when I don't feel good after eating it's because I eat, if I eat too much and I'm still hungry.
Yeah, I was really hungry. I only ate in the morning and it's like 10 here. Because I was busy. I should keep myself busy more often. Yeah, the Taco Bell here doesn't serves good quality like meat. I don't know if it's because it's halal, but the chicken is like real chunks of chicken, not that pressed crap. You know? No, I didn't order out earlier. Taco Bell isn't it's not spicy. That they call that hot sauce. My tongue is a barely a tickling. <laughs> no, I, I I don't. I test my blood sugar in the morning, and that's about it. I love the terrible Taco Bell. I know. Yeah, people don't scare me when they say, like, you should see how it's made. So what? It tastes good. The end result. <laughs> Kuwait spicy is different from Western spicy. Maybe. Yeah, I hate picking my finger. I don't like it. I always go. <laughs> Persian Zeresh Kolo. No, I haven't. I am French Canadian. Yeah. I just had Taco Bell for dinner. Is this the bag? Is this bag? I don't want to have a supporting table. So, um, there's actually like a bowl of garlic on the table for some reason. <clears throat> I thought no more fast food. Fast food to me. I don't know. I don't think I'll ever be able to eliminate fast food. The thought of eating completely healthy all the time depresses me to a level where I just don't even want to deal i would rather not even like to live a life eating only healthy food i don't want to do it like i don't want to live my life that way i don't know i know that sounds bad but i don't want to eat only unhealthy food all the time either though i want to eat like a mix you know <laughs> belly you're ha you're not you're happy after a certain amount of years of marriage that does happen doesn't it <laughs> Yeah, it is depressing. I don't know. So, anyway, that's all gone. Did you like your food, babe? Are you full? <laughs> I'm not full. It takes a while to build habits. You can always ease into it. Yeah, for sure. <clears throat> 23 years. Wow. Wow. Poor Salah. What, what am I doing to Salah? If Salah's not happy, he doesn't have to be with me, right? So. You didn't finish it? Uh-oh. I'm, I'm not even full. I'm not even full. Do you miss the villa back in Canada? Also the computer chair you had there. Yeah, I miss my computer chair. I miss my wheelie chair in the kitchen. I don't have a chair in the kitchen. So now I have to, like, stand all the time. <laughs> oh, well. Breaks are good for marriage. Yeah. It, it's like they say, keep things healthy, you know? My eyebrows are greasy from my moisturizer. Bring those leftovers. Yeah, bring them pronto. <laughs> I'm not physically full. <laughs> Need to get two quesadillas next time. Angry bonus daughter. <laughs> the name. Hello. <clears throat> you want to be proposed to? Yeah, making it yourself would probably be more filling for sure. <laughs> uh, it's hot in here. <laughs> no, the brownie's gone, obviously. It's been a few days. They don't last forever. But Salah had the last one. Or did I eat it? I don't even remember, honestly. Her stomach is probably stretched out. Yeah, of course it is. Maybe. I don't know. Is that true that it stretches? Like, stays stretched? Or does it go back? Does it only stretch when you fill it with food? I don't know. <clears throat> mm. I don't know, guys. I'm just tired of of diets. That's why I'm in between them right now, so... Brownie blackout. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> uh, I don't have any backup quesadilla. I don't like diets. I hate them. Eggs on legs. That's private. I want to go. I want to go lay on the couch. <laughs> juice. Oh, juicy juice. <laughs> Uh, ow, my sciatica. <laughs> uh, good night. Oh, the pickle fries. I don't have, yeah, I don't have any good cheese for that. Stop talking about diet and wait 24. Yeah. 
No, it's comfortable. It's comfortable this position. Slay Jute, stop licking your lips. Everyone doesn't like the noise. Hey. Oh, big yawn. Big yawn. Oh, you love your mom, mom? And your tell tells. Hi, Tracy. Don't drink juice. <laughs> you pretty girl. One of my cats looks just like Juice, except he is all gray and his face don't look like he ran into a wall. <laughs> yeah, the sciatica is so much better laying down. Juice! She does look like she got punched in the face. Nobody better ever punch you in the face! Iona. <laughs> oh, I want a blizzard, but I can't. Maybe a bite. She is so cute. I know. Seal position on the couch is the new mama. I want to go to Tim Hortons. No, they didn't give me good pain pills. No narcotics. So I'm taking NSAIDs and Olfin, which is like, I don't know what, Diclonifac? Hello, Living Laura. She has a fluffy tail, yeah. I want to get Tim Hortons. Mm. Yeah, every mug. And that's expensive here? No, not really. Depends what it is. Like Ozempic is, yeah. Give her catnip. I know, PETA. <laughs> after my... Thanks, Casey. After my, um... My surgery... Whoa. After my surgeries, they always give me dilaudid, and I'm always sad when I run out. So yeah, I know, that's not good for me to have with an addictive personality. <clears throat> really? Like, because of companies like Tim Hortons? Why? I don't know what I want. Probably a double double with Splenda. And I want to try their mushroom truffle cheese pastry thing. I hate adulting. So do I. So do I. They have Timbits, but I don't think so. My teeth I have Pepsi teeth right now. <laughs> I gotta go see Dr. Teeth. Uh, I'm not gonna hospital bees because my kidney infection is pretty pretty much cleared up and I'm taking all my meds when I miss meds that's a problem they have pizza now I did try it before they don't have it here the pizza there's no Dairy Queen but there's something called KDD my eyebrows thank you Iona <laughs> really they're too skinny or something I don't know I guess I have to have something skinny <laughs> there's a donut place here called Winchell's blueberry fritter <laughs> oh stop uh, <laughs> that sounds so good. Or like, it's like lobster season in like the East Coast, right? Oh, yes. <sighs> I'm living on the edge, Disney. Where did Salah go? Where did you go? Excuse me, sorry. Where did you go? Where did you go, babe? Yeah, I miss a lot of food places from Canada. I don't know. Tim Hortons, that's why I wanted to go. <laughs> Coffee McQueen, usually Fortnite or stuff on Oculus, but I got it in a Mario mood. I would play Mario right now. He's hiding his quesadilla. <laughs> yes. Yeah, where's your leftover quesadilla, buddy? I've been to Nova Scotia, yeah. I used to live in Prince Edward Island for a few months. I miss Pizza Pizza. I'm having boiled chicken and raw veggies. Yeah, that's what you guys want me to eat. That's what you want me to eat. <laughs> really, Melly? Tim Hortons was the highlight of the trip? Do you want more taco, babe? <laughs> no, it's okay. It's yours. <laughs> Trigger warning. Don't yell at me. <laughs> that's what you want! You want me to eat boiled cabbage and steamed chicken breast with no skin! Oh, sorry. <clears throat> You're gonna get it! Broccoli with cottage cheese and mustard. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Potato diet, then chicken diet. No! Go eat another chicken sausage. Who did I say that to? I'm hiding my teeth because they're freaking Pepsi yellow. I need to see Dr. Teeth. Boiled egg with mustard and Old Bay seasoning. Wow. <laughs> if you put a pinch of... I'm crying because somebody said something about boiled vegetables and plain chicken. Babe. Here, here, what? You're not gonna eat it? I told you. Can I have my Pepsi Max, please? 
I eat more than my friggin' husband! Okay. Thank you. I'm starving. I don't know why. <laughs> it must be the weather. <laughs> I do like veggies also. You know, you saw me eat Brussels sprouts. I'm so hungry, Peter. Eat like my husband for a day? No way. He eats like once a day. What's happening? <laughs> Babe, I'm freaking out. Insulin can increase hunger. Oh, great. Actually, Salah doesn't like Taco Bell that much. I give it a 2 out of 5, but when I rage. The Fiesta fries. I don't want any more of those. I hate the Diet Police. Uh, It's kind of my fault. Because people, because I talk about my health. But I just can't live a life like of eating only like like Brenda said, boiled cabbage and like healthy stuff. Hi Diane. Toonie Tuesday. There still is one. It's a backup quesadilla. It's a love leftovers. Not every meal has to be takeout, no. I made shepherd's pie. A cheat day once a week. It's whenever you say once a week, then whenever you start putting these food rules, then I freak out. Melly. Babe, if you get hungry after, I'll make you some fried eggs. I do love, I do love vegetables also. Rat face. No, Grandma G, I know how to eat and lay down very well. Check your blood sugars more than once a day. Like, not before bed, really. I'm done eating now, sushi girl. Brownie experiment. <laughs> I didn't eat pickles with my meal. How can I do that? Get a cheat day once a week, right after high school? I haven't seen the dietitian yet, but I will be seeing them soon. I just can't go right this second because, uh, yeah, I have to wait for an appointment. But they're going to tell me to eat boiled vegetables. I know it. You can tell someone who binges to restrict because it's true. Those brownies were so good, though. Oh, my gosh. They had chocolate chunks inside. Babe? Yes, I Do you want more? Oh, no, thanks, babe. I'm <laughs> fine. Some water, maybe? Mm -hmm. And, you know, someone likes a lot. He doesn't know anything. Before you met me, you didn't understand the concept of, like obesity and eating disorders and stuff but once you love someone it's too late trapped no, i'm just joking <laughs> oh yeah obese <laughs> <Stop. laughs> it's funny eh? babe yeah did you put the thing back in front of the fridge because the stuff will get warm which one the container no uh the fridge it's closed properly right yeah, yeah. okay sometimes it doesn't close properly so <clears throat> It's the worst thing. You come, I wake up, I go to get some cold water. Everything's warm in the fridge. He's a good husband, he is. I'm a very, very willful individual. And nobody can tell me no, trust me. You should attend the diabetes class? Yeah, baby, you should come with me, my sweetest love. I'm sure that's what he feels like doing. <laughs> Obies. <laughs> no, I, I, I eat those Brussels sprouts. Like, I love them. Hi, Jen Marie. <gasps> I should make some right now. I won't put butter. Just Brussels sprouts, salt, pepper, and okay, maybe a little bit of butter because you need something for the um, Worcester sauce to adhere to. <laughs> no, we always joke about stuff like that. <laughs> Your man's at the gym getting hit on? Well, he could be hit on, but. Oh, these is a funny one. Brussels sprouts with parm. <clears throat> it's not plant based butter. Country crock! I used to love that. I used to eat it with a spoon. <laughs> I'm so see I want to be in between that like I want to eat like a normal person like a normal person can just eat like whatever you know 
Add vegetables. Yeah, I'm trying to add more vegetables. Yeah, if I sit too long, my sciatica acts up, yeah. Obese. Yeah, obese. <laughs> and it's funny because <laughs> English, babe, like some some words he'll learn for the first time in English and he'll like say them over just to, like to learn them more. And obese was one of them. <laughs> but he also the word bees. So one day in bed we're like, obese. <clears throat> hey, babe. For plumpness, being chubby. I guess collagen. Hey, Hugo. Oh, chocolate chip cookie. He learned obese quick, yeah. My sister messaged me today. I miss you. I hope you're doing well. I miss my sis. I do. <clears throat> I can do sit-ups, actually. I'm, I'm actually not that bad. I'm not that bad. Country crock is like a butter spread, but it's not butter. It's like hydrogenated oil. Chemicals. <laughs> Pat node. Are you French? I eat a slice of two or pizza. You eat the whole thing. Yeah, that's the thing. Depends how hungry I am. Maybe if I did eat little small meals throughout the day, but this is the thing. Like, I hate planning stuff like this. <clears throat> Your whole life is a planning food? You have to make yourself eat breakfast so I wouldn't overeat. Yes, you're right, because whenever you, you miss breakfast, like, let's say when I was working in an office, like, I would be, oh my gosh, <clears throat> I would obsess about food. Like, every day we would get the cafeteria menu sent to our email. So I would log in, have, have usually have a muffin and coffee, and then just, like, browse through the lunch cafeteria menu for like ever that's sad and the food wasn't even good their cafeteria food sucked and now that i'm not working there i can say whatever i want to about them <laughs> i love that nice chili paneer <gasps> the food i know the food at disney yeah they have fat friendly rides i told Salah that <clears throat> i'm just struggling guys with like eating healthy all the time i don't know what i don't think so buddy Country crock, I know. My ham? Excuse me, I know I know you meant that, you freaking troll. This is from my IV. <laughs> what would you rather, a chubby soft hand or a bony cold one full of veins? When I worked selling insurance, they always had catering from restaurants like toys. <laughs> yeah, I know. Every t every office job I worked at had food. Whatever I worked at for home health care in the office. Yeah, Koshka. Um, um, first of all, the boss would bring in fresh bagels from Kettleman's Bagels and cream cheese. And then somebody would always bring in treats. I don't know. Yeah, it was always good. Good food. And the delivery. Okay, here's the thing with the services. They make me binge. You know why? Because they it's only 1,100 calories. And they give you one small little side salad. Hi, Laurel. Thank you. Okay, the breakfast for the diet box service, the breakfast was, um, yeah, friend chemistry. The, the it, one was a croissant with like some labda on it. That's not a good breakfast for, I don't know. I mean, I would probably eat that anyway, but come on. Like if you're paying all that money to eat healthy, deliver food and it's not. Oui, je parle français, mais pas très bien parce que je pratique pas. Malheureusement. No, I'm supposed to eat like 1900 according to my fitness pal. If you want to lose like realistically like two pounds a week but even yeah even 1500 like is way better than 1100 that's like starvation mode binge city coming coming along that's like eating disorder development no way hi little nitty yeah i know subway i love the smell of subway when i was a kid i wanted to be many things i wanted to be an astronaut i wanted to be a professor yeah you can take it too far with restricting for sure I did not go out today, and I have no problem with that. Her coloring is, I know, she's a torty. Juice is so cute, babe. I used to be super restrictive and weighed all my foods. Oh, it sounds like torture. <laughs> Don't deprive myself of any food except sugary desserts. Yeah, I mean, I, I know, like, I still eat some junk there like this, but I try not to eat. I know I had the brownie, but... Pipi <laughs> gyal! I try not to eat, like, too many desserts and chocolates and things like that. I, I do honestly rarely eat those. But I do crave them, I'm not gonna lie. The veggie nut bean burrito fresco style? Yeah, I'm diabetic chef for a week. Oh yeah, I'm real rich. <laughs> I wonder how much it would be. 30 day diet challenge. Taylor, yes, 25 is very worrisome. But it hasn't been like that, knock on wood. It's usually that high? 
25 MMOL when I don't take my meds consistently and I have an infection in my body. The Werthers are done. <laughs> I hate them all. They're so good. <clears throat> Christmas party Werthers. Now at our Christmas parties, usually the um, Toffees or um, Toblerone. Always there's a Toblerone. How do you eat a Toblerone without like stabbing your mouth? The word diet should be banned. I've been to many. Th I've been to many therapists. Many. Doesn't it doesn't work for me? I don't know. Maybe I need a long term, but I'm not ready for that crap right now. Hi, B. Thank you. Have a good day. 2 p.m. in Edmonton. It's almost 11 p.m. here. So I'll probably get off of here in a bit. And then, uh, yeah, I've tried swimming. I've swam I have some swimming videos on my, you know. You gotta want to change, I know. <clears throat> my feet? No. <laughs> I told you Hi, Jaina! My feet are fine. You should have seen my feet many years ago. Right now they're skinny. There's no, um, as you can see. <sighs> What's the next movie? I want to watch something scary, babe. There's no edema. Like one time, oh my gosh, I remember one year when I was working, maybe 2000 and a, 2000 and maybe seven or eight. My feet were so swollen. I could barely wear my shoes and I could press my foot. And it would stay like that. That hasn't happened to me in years. My feet are not like that anymore. So my feet are fine. My hair is long, yeah. But it's thin. Hey Tristan Manny, I work for a nonprofit that does trauma informed nutrition. It's hard to be patterns. But we have to try. It is very hard, yeah. Very long legs. I heard it's scary too. Your feet are so small. How did I know? Poor feet. Treats from scratch? That's a good idea, Koshka. My hair's like to here, like down my back. Horror movie it is. Yeah, that's good. If you can, if you can fight it, it's good. I'm five foot one. Well, my license, one hundred and fifty-five centimeters. What is that? Yeah, maybe I'll bake with uh, Stevie or Splenda. Yeah, you're right. Oh, Tusk is so sad. It makes me mad. I saw feet. Happy feet. <laughs> I have weird looking feet, but did you see my feet? I can show my feet. There you go. <laughs> There's so many good diabetic recipes. No, covering it probably made it worse. It's still thin on top here. I have huge bunions. Oh no. My sister painted my toes. And I didn't take it off yet. What thing near my belly? <laughs> what thing? This? What? The quesadilla bag, I have water. <laughs> it was in April. April of May, May to June. It's only three months. I need a pedicure really bad. Yes, I watched. Actually, I don't think ever in my life I've ever, like, ever scrubbed my feet. I just let the water and the shampoo and the, sh and the soap wash them in the shower. <laughs> They're fine. <laughs> Hobbit feet. Babe, do you remember the hobbit's feet? <laughs> ah! Babe, the curtain ghost. Or the ghost curtain. <laughs> My feet never smell. And they're not black. <laughs> I said I never watch anything below the equator. <laughs> What's the point? Your legs don't stink. No, I'm kidding. Well, I'm gonna shave my legs. <laughs> Mr. Frodo. Sam. Sam Weiss. Cheese toes. Comes off like Parmesan. <laughs> I need to just get a, I need to go get a pedicure. That's it. Like go to the salon. It's better. <laughs> the sketches. <laughs> Cheese feet. Chantel Hobbit confirmed. <laughs> yep. Yeah, we're, <laughs> we're I need more elven bread. Cheese curds between your toes. No, I spread my toes and the soap goes between. And I don't have earwax and I don't have BO. Ever. What's this? Juice! Juice! 
I choose. Oh, your feet are cute. Oh, you're so cute. I love you. Oh, my baby girl. You can wear open toes, yeah. There's a lot of women from the wet, like women from the west who live here. They don't cover their hair. They don't. A lot of them. Cheese teeth. Yeah, I have Pepsi Max teeth right now. I love getting pedicures. I like never like I like wearing Jordan because I like the smell, but I like never wear it and I never have bo. Never armpit bo ever. I am a I am a hobbit. Love staying at home. <laughs> Eats first and second breakfast and the feet. I am a hobbit and I'm short. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Pepsi tea. Coming up, Kate. Sophia, all my, my mukbangs pre-hijab are, are hidden. I don't wash my feet or wear deodorant. The feet wash themselves. No, I do, I do, I don't need to wear deodorant, no. But I do have deodorant that I wear sometimes. You like pre-hijab videos? Well, let me tell you. Yeah, so no, I don't smell. Like, otherwise I would wear deodorant. But my feet don't smell. So most people, if they don't wear deodorant, they have BO. It's normal. Yeah, I don't have earwax, like, ever. I never clean my ears. Or dry earwax. Yeah, like, it's like maybe a few flakes once in a while. But. <laughs> I do, I think I have that weird gene because I never have to, my pits never stink. No matter how much I sweat. Believe me, doctors have seen and heard it all and appreciate honesty. My son's an internal medicine doctor. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure, you know. No, it's blind. ABCC11 gene. It's very common in Asian cultures, but rare in Caucasians. Really? Do you think I'm Asian? Oh. Anyways, guys. No, I do my own insulin. It burns a little bit. Anyways, this is my new favorite position for live streams. Scrub my feet for the first time ever. Yeah, it's part of voodoo, but I don't put my leg on the sink and scrub it like freaking normal thin people. I just rinse them. <laughs> I bet you'd be a good... <laughs> Are you kidding? <laughs> I bet you'd be a good dancer. Please do an impression of a lobster. Um, how does her hands look again? <clears throat> okay. Um, no, what? They don't have a mouth? They have googly eyes. Like... <laughs> What do you mean everyone says that, Blue Pot? Nobody says that. Yeah, but I don't go in public to do woo-doo. I do it here. I should, get, I should get my ancestry done, yeah. Result. Wonder Bread. <laughs> okay, bye. Enjoy, Melly. Babe, where'd you go? <laughs> That's Noah Lobster and a googly eyes. A few people have said it. Who's a few people? Who cares? <laughs> No one said it. We saw it, girl. You can't do voodoo on your feet in the shower instead of the sink. No, you can use the hose. <laughs> Shut up, you're making me reveal all my secrets. <laughs> Hello, Robin! You are late. You're do you hear Julia eating crunchies? Babe, thanks for giving me your leftover kisses leftovers. Your love leftovers. What's going on? Nothing. We're just beezing. Actually I am full now. I'm in Kroger grocery shopping. That sounds fun. What's it smell like? I want to swim with dolphins. They have little teeth and they're so cute. I want to kiss them. I got quesadilla. Well, it's called Double Dia Taco Tuesday. Two for one deal. You did what in the Bahamas? You kissed a dolphin? Oh, Leslie, okay. What Are they cute? Do they smell fishy? Like, what? what's the deal? They look like they would have the, the texture of an olive. Oh, I want to swim with dolphins. It's a double dia. <laughs> My nose is clogged with nose cheese. Yeah, I'm okay, artist. I never heard that song. I'm always laying down. Taco lasagna? What the heck is that? Instead of noodles, you use tortillas? I saw Midsummer. <laughs> no, you're not going to poo and then come right in my face. Come here. Here. She's a weird color, isn't she? Mmm, seafood lasagna? Walnut crunch. Oh, I want to go to Tim Hortons, babe. No, I don't like Terrifier. It's gross. <clears throat> What's your wife's name? Hi, the face's wife. You're just a kitten cat. Yay. Yes, you are. 
your beige here, your beige here. Don't bite mom. If you bite mom, I'm going to tell dad that if you bite mom. Ow! Babe! Ow! She bit mom. Why are you biting mom? It's closed now. It's 24 hours. I'm just joking. I know. I, I'm just kidding. Seafood lasagna is not yum. Why? As long as there's no salmon. <laughs> is he lying? <laughs> no, I can't go to Tim Hortons tonight. The thing? Yeah, I want a donut, but I can't eat it. I'm, I can't be bad. I guess I'll make sugar-free jello. Hey, <laughs> drink me a peppers. whoop de doo da day Sugar-free jello. Woo! <laughs> I just want an apple fritter. Release those emails? Oh, yeah. I can. I don't care. No. Don't have any brownies. 11-11, babe. Let's celebrate with some brownies. No, I'm kidding. Actually, bean brownies? Yeah, I've tried them. They're not bad. Tim Hortons, Mabula Beach. Look at, babe, look at Brenda on Google. <laughs> no, maybe tomorrow, guys, we'll go. I don't feel like going out. Honestly, I don't. I'm feeling okay. I'm just a bit tired. It's 11 here. I made a box of brownies. And Salah, Salah ate most of them. I always blame him. No, he did eat most of them. I had two brownies, okay? If I go, I'm probably going to go live. Because we have to try the Tim Hortons in Kuwait. The double double. You're sleepy, Breeze? No Tim Horton bees? Why? I can make diabetic friendly. I'm going to buy some sweetener somewhere. Double double in a walnut crunch. She deserves it. Yeah, tomorrow. High protein breakfast. Maybe I can eat some protein and drink a unicity and then have a donut. It'll soften the blow a bit instead of just. It, it does. If you eat protein and then like the fiber from the unicity, it's definitely better than just like eating that straight up. Ice caps are so sweet. Someone called you middle-aged and my age starts with a three. <laughs> oh, gosh. I'm definitely middle-aged. Probably over the hill. Stay strong. I didn't I didn't finish my experiments. I lost interest. I was in the library. Oh. American Jello has pork. Yeah, not here. Kathy. Ah, yeah, I love berries. Pork. Pork's illegal here. Yeah, I don't. I used to hate Jello. Hate Jello, but I like. Uh, I don't know. I'm starting to like it a little bit. I guess. I don't know if we have sugar-free whipped cream. I guess I could just buy whip, whipping cream. It doesn't give you license, but it helps. I guess if you're going to. You know. I don't. I don't. I don't love ice caps. Honestly, I find them a bit too sweet. I had them once in a while, but make a fruit salad with sugar-free whipped. Animal hooves? Yum. If we eat other parts of the animal, I guess. Why not? But if I make jello now, I have to wait for it to set. You have to wait at least four hours. I'm going to have a breakdown. Walnut crunch. Walnut crunch. Maybe tomorrow. That'll be on my brain. Double, double. It's too hot to even go to the beach. Ugh. No humidity, uh, I guess. But Tell us a story about what? I had tacos today, dreaming of Everest. No, I had quesadilla. Double dia. Quinoa. Yeah, Kathy, I have quinoa trauma. What did I eat today? I had a mango yogurt, a few grapes, and the Taco Bell. Hibachi? Yeah, mom corner. Enjoy. <laughs> I do. Italian food? Enjoy your six pack. Rub it in, why don't you? <clears throat> Did anyone stand me up? I don't think so. Yeah, I have member subscriptions. I think I want to play my, my scary game and have a coffee, or have a tea. And my blueberry, a bit of my blueberry vape. Live and let bees! Yes, we got a bees. Let, live and let bees. <sighs> Living on the edge! Andre Maria had a super healthy friend in college who always ate quinoa. I hate it. I like it with feta cheese and olives, maybe only. No. Biking? I kind of wish I had a bike. Have a good day, you too, artist. Phasmophobia, we're going to ghost hunt. Yeah, I'll probably go live and do it, even though nobody watches. Maybe 30 people, but that's okay. Chili pistachios. I've had barbecue with pistachios. We're beezing on the edge. You can't help yourself, but I'm beezing. Why was he holding his... There's something wrong with the world today. 
I don't vape, but I'm craving it right now. I go through beast phases. <gasps> Popsicles! You work with ghosts? I don't know about top three, but I definitely the shining is in there. We want a fried egg vlog. You can't quit vaping. It's my only vice. <sighs> I know, I have a hard time like raw dogging life. Not on Twitch, on YouTube probably. Collective Soul. I used to love that song, Where the River Flows. <laughs> I don't know the words, but... <laughs> okay, I'll give her kisses, blush. Cheers! Come here, baby. Come. Come. Good girl. Come see mom. Come see mom. Come see mom. Come see mom. Good girl. Come see mom. I gotta kiss you. Okay, I'll kiss her when she comes over here. I sometimes vape, but not, not often. Raw dogging life. That's what it is. Imagine you live a life of going to the gym two hours a day, eating super clean quinoa, no smoke, nothing, no walnut crunch. Your, your dinner is like steamed white fish with lemon. You love quinoa? I like it more than I did. I think I'm getting over the trauma. Anyways, I never told you where the initial trauma came from. When I first went to Katimovic, okay, I was like six, I was 17. Well, I got off the bus, and it was a long bus ride all the way to Mattawa, Ontario. Stop this at once. Stop this at once. Anyway, I was starving. Starving. Okay, and I was it was freezing. I got dropped off at a bus stop, and I had to walk down the street in the freezing cold snow. Um... They didn't plow the street. There was one plow man for the entire city. I remember the plow guy. I think his name was Bert. Anyway. Stop it! Shoes! Go see that! Look at this little gremlin. She's attacking the curtains. Stop it, guys! Okay. And we, I get there to the house. And you're, I'm looking forward to like... Because when you first get there, the, the team leader is supposed to have a nice meal for you. Ready? We had... Lucky me! We had a friggin' vegan! I'm just kidding. I love vegans. <laughs> Anyways, this one was... She made us quinoa soup. <laughs> so it was literally water with a few flakes of quinoa and some zucchini. I don't know what the heck that was. That was not very nice, okay? <sighs> yeah. She has two scratch pads. She has a scratch pad and a scratch post. Don't look at me like that. She's looking at me like <laughs> I'm getting people to judge you. I'm telling you. Cats are evil. That's why I like them. Juice. Juice. Tell the people that you're beezing. You're evil. Look at you. <laughs> and the curtains. I bet it was good for you. I don't know. That house was haunted as heck. There was like a former like guy. He hung himself in the basement. People. <laughs> Her glowing eyes. You're evil. You're evil. And you fooled the people. Yeah, she could have put something like some chickpeas in there. Nail reveal? I have cuticles. Anyway, I gotta go. They don't have slurpee. They have slushies at the juice shop, though. And you can get the mix. Two different colors. She didn't know how to cook. She didn't know how to cook. She was the worst team lead. And you, you get there and you're tired and you know what we had to do? We had to build our own bunk beds before we got to sleep. I'm not even kidding. Like, we go into the room, the girls' room, and there's all these wood planks on the floor and, like, a bucket of nails. <laughs> She's like, you have to make your own beds. And I'm like, whoa! What the hell do we... Government-funded uh, program. <sighs> no, her being vegan had nothing to do with it. But she didn't understand vegan protein sources, apparently. Eh, I'm happy. What, do I look miserable? The vegan thing years ago. Yeah, that was tough. <laughs> These programs. Even in the programs, I was pretty lazy. I went voluntarily. Because I got to miss school. But then I ended up loving it. Hummus. Good night, Hugo. You're not happy? Actually, that's why I became best friends with this one girl. She was a newfie. <laughs> and she was so awesome. We were both Aries. And we went, we used to go and like eat out after eating their crappy food. When we lived in Quebec, we lived across from a Poutinière, 
poutinerie. Oh my gosh, I still remember the order. A, a large poutine with extra cheese curds and a side of mayonnaise and a Pepsi. We'd be like, we're just going for an after, we're just going for an after dinner walk. We had an allowance of $21 a week. I bought cigarettes and puts in allowance. I don't know. Of course, like my mom and my grandmother give me money all the like give me money. <clears throat> really, Yoda? I cooked, yeah. Me and my best friend. Dredge. Cool, Kathy. Yeah, it was everyone had a turn. You had a, you were um two people at a time. Well, one time I was with this, like, you, you switch who you were housemates with all the time. Thanks, Austin. I know, Brenda. Queen foodie, queen foodie, queen foodie. I wanted to do evil queen makeup today. I guess tomorrow. But yeah, we, I cooked really good things. We had to break, first of all, every day you had to break, you had to bake 12 loaves of bread. One loaf for each person. Oh my gosh, bread friggin' bread, bread mornings were the best. You had to do the groceries. That was my job, actually, when I worked at a women's shelter. I had to cook for them. And I, I made, like, cherry cheesecake tarts. A whole... Ro well, I made roast pork, but I wasn't muzzled back then. With, like, a, a cinnamon... With, like, a really yummy, like, um... I don't know. It's like a glaze. I can't remember what I put in it, though. But I, maybe it's not cinnamon. I don't know. Pineapple, maybe? I don't know. They loved it. And I watched soap operas with them. And, like, gossiped with them. And... Organized all the donations, the clothing. Like, folded them and stuff. Yeah, it was fun. I liked it. That was my favorite job, I think, was working at the the women's shelter for abused women. Yeah, I know, Bupot. I don't remember what you made for dinner in the 90s. If you ate that dinner, Brenda, you would never forget it. All the women were, like, sitting around and they, they loved it. Like, just to see the joy on their face from eating what I made them was so nice. Yeah, I've seen Willy Wonka. They loved it. They loved it. I'll never forget it. And I used to make homemade butter tarts like butter no what is it called pecan pie tarts <gasps> I used to cook a lot it's so it's volunteering like it's a program for youth to like travel around Canada and volunteer so you volunteered 40 hours a week like a normal job you got paid 21 bucks a week but they paid your accommodation your plane ticket like your how to get there and at the end of the program you get to choose if you wanted they pay your transportation home or they give you the money equivalent and a lot of people just took that and kept traveling but no, I, I took the money equivalent because my my mom and my stepdad and my baby sister came to pick me up. And I thought I would be so happy to go home because I missed my family. But I was like, I was, I found myself bawling my eyes out. Like the thought of leaving 12 people that you live with for like seven months, you know? Or was it nine months? I don't remember. But it was an experience. It was really fun. Oh yeah, somebody asked me if I went to Nova Scotia. Yes, because we traveled to Nova Scotia when I was living in PEI. And I went to Cape Breton Island, which was one of my favorite places in Canada. It's beautiful. If you want to go whale watching, you should go there. Anyway, I lived with an old woman and her dog. That was boring. That was so boring. She had no snacks in her house. <laughs> she had like stale Triscuits. I have Triscuit trauma. I miss Farm Boy, yeah. I miss the cheese section and the olive bar. Actually, Farm Boy, when I was working at the office, I always used to drive down to the Farm Boy, like up the street from where I worked. And got the hot bar lunch and it smelled up i put so much parmesan cheese on it that it smelled the whole office and i got in trouble <clears throat> they have this homemade they have this mac and cheese with their meatballs their homemade meatballs <gasps> chocolate chips yep ingredient house cold yeah she had triscuits she didn't have anything to snack on freedom of movement mm, no well, I mean, I can't just go anywhere I want, like, at any time, like, in Canada, but, I mean, obviously, I, I can't drive here, so. I do miss driving sometimes, yeah, but. So, like I said, if I ever want to go anywhere, and, you know, he'll take me anywhere. I'm a passenger princess. Cool. Anyway. Ottawa's your favorite city? Really? I lived in Snorleans. <laughs> you should cook some. It is a pretty city, though. Childhood meals? I do. He finds it a bit weird. He found the, the cottage pie. He thought it was okay, but he thought it was, like, weird. I don't know. Do I go anywhere? Sometimes. Lately, not really since I've been sick, but... I have trouble. Like, I have to force myself sometimes, because I like to stay in. My beautiful passenger princess. <laughs> if so lost, how do you take you anywhere? Why aren't you currently en route to the 24-hour Tim Hortons on Mabula Beach? <laughs> Tomorrow. 
<laughs> right, babe, tomorrow, inshallah. Do you do rat face because you think it's cute? No, it's a habit. It's a hobbit habit. Shut it, horn. Juice. This is so comfy. A metro? Tomorrow, yes. Okay, I'm going to look up what kind of donuts they have. I want... It's a treat. It's just a treat. I'm going to get a coffee with Splenda and a walnut crunch. <laughs> True, Yoda. Let's get some white strips. I have a white whitening toothpaste. I haven't opened it yet. <sighs> All right, we're going to Turkey to get turkey teeth. <gasps> Sour cream glazed is my favorite, Brenda. How did you know? Behind Boston cream. I'm just going to get one. Babe, you've never tried donuts from... T you never tried Tim Hortons. You have to try. Okay, Salah and I will share so that it's less of a... <clears throat> I have to earn my treat. What should I do? I'll wash the baseboards. Maple bar? I brush my teeth. I do actually brush my teeth. The duster. <laughs> Composite veneers. I was going to talk like this with the veneers in your mouth. The fake ones there that you pop in and out. Air fried Cajun salmon, red lobster biscuits, gouda mac and cheese, and roasted broccoli. Excuse me, let's get married. Okay. <laughs> Krispy Kreme's plain glazed donuts are one of my favorite. They're so good, Krispy Kreme. <sighs> yes. We're going to share. I'm just going to have a bite of the donut. Sweat into the oldies. Yeah, I've had baked potato, loaded baked potatoes. I used to get the Wendy's baked potato, the cheese and bacon one with extra cheese sauce, a side of sour cream, and their buffalo ranch, and I would put it all on the potato. <laughs> oh my god. That's so bad. Why are you unable to cook homemade tacos? Um, well, I just don't feel like it. Once you buy all the ingredients, it's a fortune. Plus, I don't know, standing too long to like cook and everything hurts my sciatica, especially after washing the floors today and doing the stove. And you get buy one, get one free today at Taco Bell. But I can make my own tacos, I guess. But you know why, honestly? The taco kits here are important, the taco shells. And they're super expensive, like 12 bucks. I just... No, and they were stale! Last time I made my own tacos, the taco shells were stale. But thanks for the super chat, by the way. <clears throat> Maybe he does want me dead. Would you want to live with me? I'm just joking. <laughs> of course not. Listen, I'm 40. Stop blaming him for my decisions. I'm responsible for myself. Okay. Most of the time he does give me crap for things I shouldn't be eating. And I still, I'm, I'm allowed to do what I want. Yeah, I had a quesadilla today. Exactly. That's exactly right. Yep, 12 bucks. Yep. Like 3KD or like, it's at like 10 bucks. Whatever. He, he, trust me, he, he tells me like, you know. He doesn't, uh, it's not his responsibility. I get my own food. Yeah. Hey, Gizmo. Tortillas would be expensive. Actually, the, yeah, the flour tortillas are cheap here. They always have them on sale. <sighs> Could you get food if you didn't get it? Of course I can get food. I'm not bed bound. Like, I can get my own food, you know? Yeah, give me the leftovers. Oh, well. You can probably grab them anyways. <laughs> I go grab them and run away with them. Gimme! Imagine. <laughs> I'm still hungry, but I'm not going to eat. No, I'm not hungry, actually. If I really think about it, no. <sighs> Look at my waist is snatched. So, don't worry about me. I can go out alone. I did before once or twice. <laughs> Drink a ton of water. Corned beef or chorizo, soft tortillas are yummy. Yes. It's snatched. Look. It goes in. The hamburger. <laughs> Get your cardio and stealing leftovers. It's called Love Leftovers. <laughs> he was probably concerned because you guys were going, Salah, she needs another taco stat. She needs another quesadilla. Wait and see how many more on channels will talk about how I gave you my food. Of course, yes. I know, babe. Just ignore. I'm 40. I make my own decisions. You know, what I want to put in my body. <sighs> my teeth are yellow, I know. 
You know, I make a treat. Sugar-free chocolate jello pudding instead of milk. Core protein. Oh, cool. Pudding pops. I like freezing yogurts and eating them like that. It's not your chat, but you're, you're like grandfathered in, I guess. Snatched waist. Do you have hips that you can do this to? <laughs> I'm kidding. Bay. You should measure your waist. I don't have a measuring tape. So, it's not gonna happen. Teardrop! I was wondering where you were. I'm just joking. <laughs> That's okay, sweethearts. Hey, where we're at. Hourglass. Yeah, I have hourglass. See, look. I have a big belly, but. And a bunch of bad, my hips don't lie, and a shot of peanut butter. You're not allowed to be blocked, yes. Don't be jealous. Plain cheeseburgers with pickles. <laughs> oh, you're babysitting. Aw, sweet. <laughs> Cuties. So, God bless them, Grandma. Yes. Vanessa, the emojis. <laughs> you made breakfast. What'd you have? Spam? Masubi? King Beezer. <laughs> My teeth are so yellow today. What's going on? Ew. <laughs> I'm going to do a gaming stream soon, yeah. <sighs> Even if you don't like gaming, you guys can come and hang out if you want. In chat. But I'm going to be ghost hunting. I scare myself. Ah, uh, no, Jose. You want a, an Italian wife, right? That's what I remember. My teeth match the couch. <laughs> uh, I'm going to make a, a tea. They're going to even be more yellow. Whitener gel from the dentist. It takes two. What is that? It takes two, baby. It takes two, baby. Just me and you. It takes two. Healthcare's pretty good here, Brick Bong. Yellow's the new white. <laughs> I don't know why they're like that. <laughs> but it's grossing me out. I need to use that whitening toothpaste. What's wrong with yellow? Yeah. There you go. I needed your positive influence teardrop. I have to try really hard. I'm just joking. Okay, should I get off? Five more minutes. I don't know any Italian. Buenos dias. Buenos noches. I don't know. Arrivederci. I know some. P plain cheeseburger and pickles. I'm just going to have a bite of the walnut crunch. And I'm going to get Splenda in my coffee. A break from heat tomorrow. Only in the 80s. Only? <laughs> well, that's better than hundreds, eh, teardrop? Waiting on Amazon. I got a whitening toothpaste from Thailand. I need to. I need to use it. Spanish, really? I don't know. Arabic, uh, shwe. Baraf shwe Arabi. Right, babe. That means I know a little bit. <laughs> yeah, Stacy, I think so. <laughs> it's like that block with like walnuts. Yeah, it looks like a turd, but it's so good. I'm missing this tooth and this tooth. The same ones. Hey, Krista! Oh, no. See, it's hot everywhere. It takes two. Half past two. Yeah, we have a pool. Do you want to make a horror movie in the pool area? Teeth are overrated. Juice! Cheese donuts? Cheese croissant. Those are... It's not in Alaska. Yeah, that's, you know. Well, these teeth, they were baby teeth, just like this one. This kernel corn one. And basically, I had teeth x-rays done. And there's no adult permanent teeth above them. So when they fall out, because the nerves, of course, it's going to happen someday. <clears throat> your baby teeth have to fall out at some point. So when this one does, I got to get a new tooth for sure, because I'll look, I'll look like Joe Pesci. But... Um, there was no teeth above it, so. And that's why I don't have wisdom teeth. That I'm not complaining about. I saw my mom go through her wisdom teeth. Ugh. I don't care if people criticize what I eat anymore, you know? 
I mean, really, why did I rage over people caring about if I eat a brownie? Who cares? I'm not perfect, and I struggle with, like I said, like eating super healthy all the time, you know? Oh, whose feet are those? What are those? Those are some friggin' feet, let me tell you. What do you do, what do you, do you little fuzzy butt? Uh-oh, you have a mat here? I gotta cut that. <sighs> On your bum. Why you have a bum? Maybe I'll get the place to do it. Yeah, maybe I have to go to Dr. Teeth. I don't want to. I don't want to live a life without Walnut Crunch. Yeah. I don't know. Anyways, hopefully I'll figure it out someday. I don't plan on eating like loads of fast food every day. Like no, like tomorrow I'm gonna cook something here. Inshallah. I want to make goulash. I took out another pound of ground beef. I don't know what to do with it, but. How do you know, Melody? With food. I just want to admit it. A lot of people in the world do, yeah. You know. But it's not fair to blame Salah at all. So don't don't listen, babe, because like it's I'm 40. Like, seriously. Like, you know, I make my decisions. I'm responsible. He 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 does advise me, like, you know, but this is all new to him as well. Really, Melody? Oh my gosh. I'm not surprised, actually. Cheese teeth. Mm. I've risen too because I have arthritis of the jaw. Really, Vanessa? Ouch. Egg fried rice? Uh, I don't think so, Ghostface. You make it. I'm sure you can. It's tough being under a microscope constantly, but there are people that truly care and want to see healthy and thriving. Thanks, Belladonna. Yeah. <laughs> babe, babe, you're going to take the class with me? So loves her husband, he doesn't make her eat. She eats what she wants, yeah. Double, double. I'm all excited, like a road trip to go to Tim Hortons and I used to not even care in Canada. I don't know, it's like different here. It's like a little piece of Canada here, you know? Just like when we drive by the embassy and I see the Canada flag. Tim Hortons. Vicodin. I don't know what that is. <laughs> Usually if I, have, if I have a surgery, they give me dilated. Yeah, Teardrop, it was nice to see you. Enjoy the time with the grandkids. <laughs> tim, 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 tim. Anyway, I'm, I think I'm going to play my, my game in a bit. Give me like a half an hour, maybe. <sighs> to go live and play. Oh, yeah, Grandma. <clears throat> I think I think lot it is, too. You know, they give you that bolus, like, after surgery. <laughs> the morphine. Uh, among Us. Gaming, yeah. Don't do anything we wouldn't do, or don't do anything you would. Okay, bye guys. I'll see you guys in a bit. Stay tuned.